Yes! Frickin' Android's got a frickin' copyright strike. Hello, YouTubes! Welcome back, Haunt Fam. Boy, today we just need some anthrax in your life. Come to Menards today. Boy, they got some Halloween stuff. 20 years worth they've been putting out cool Halloween stuff. Um, I love Menards. I called them. They did say they had their stuff out, so we should walk into a Code Orange, I hope. Uh, and if you don't have Menards by you, I don't know if it's a Chicagoland area thing, but it's a northern thing. I don't think they have Menards in Florida. Lloyd! Do they got Menards in Texas? Lloyd, go to Menards. Uh... It's sort of like a big box for like a Home Depot or a Lowe's or along those lines. You can buy like plaster and washers and dryers and drywall and crap like that there. But for the last 20 years, they've always had some great Halloween stuff here. So I always stop every year. So hopefully they've got some great stuff in store for us. Animatronics, home decor, all kinds of crap, man. Menards kills it every year, man. They put out some good stuff. So uh, we're about to perpetrate up in Menards and see what they got for this year. Let's roll. Let's go on Menards. Let's do it. Booyah. Look at all that. Jesus Christ, look at that mummy Frankenstein. He's 20 feet tall. So, we definitely have a coat orange on our hands. Eight foot mirror reaper inflatable. Did we not see that at Home Depot last year? Or at home? Looks like they got a ton of blow ups, man. Inflatables. Color changing inflatable ghost. There he goes. Yeah, you can kind of see him kind of faintly indoors. Got a busket of witches for 88 bucks. He said, man, and then we got. I gotta try and back up some so I get this whole damn thing in there. Look at this freaking guy, man. He's 20 feet tall. But they've got a ton of inflatables. They've got some big ones too. Harry Potter, uh, Pumpkin Hollow is sort of the Menards brand. But uh, man, they got Karate Kid. They got some Kung Fu. They got some vampires. There's a little. There's a little guy you can put with your big guy. Looks like they got a dragon. Let's uh, roll around the other side and see what else they got, man. I think they got uh, animatronics. Oh, here we go. Wow, look at the werewolf. I think we've seen him before. The clown is probably a rehashed spirit clown. What do you do, clown? He's got his typical clown shoes, vacuum form, kind of sucks. He's 266. But Jesus Christ, he's big. He's eight and a half feet tall. Clown, what do you do? Smoldering Ghoul, I think they brought back from last year. He's 300 bucks. He looks cool, though. He's got good lights. Now, the witch is pretty gnarly. I don't know if this is the same Home Depot one or not. It's Pumpkin Hollow brand. She's 10 foot tall, towering witch, 12 foot animated reaper, which we all know where that guy came from. At home at Home Depot last year. So here's our try me. Okay. We've seen this guy already at uh, at home this year. She got a purple dress. She got a try me. What do you do, Gypsy? Where's your button? I gotta look up her skirt, try and find her try me button. Don't worry, girl. Hope you got underwear on. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> Not yet. Uh -uh. This girl's huge. <laughs> Alright, so we've seen, man, that's our animatronic lineup so far. The wolf man, the clown. So they got some bigger blow molds down here for 44 bucks. Man, these things are just getting bigger every year, man. That's cool. And he's huge, too. He's a little narrow, but not bad. 44. Oh, here goes the smoldering ghoul again. And they got the orange version down there, too. That's a pretty good glow. So the witch, I don't know if she's Home Depot or not last year. Maybe they just put a body under her, but we'll see. Looks like they got some more blow molds. They got a clown down there in stock. Blow mold skeleton, 34. The witch's cauldron, 129. Oh, they got a Scarecrow, 89, but he's not out yet. There's a 12-foot tall animated reaper and the smoldering ghoul. So they do have stuff in stock. Oh, they got a dragon we haven't seen yet either. So for $2.99, you get the brimstone dragon, 79 inches. Looks like he's gray and red sort of like the last couple years. All right, let's dive in, man. See what else they got. Okay, so we've got silhouettes. We've got a bat, a cat. A big, huge skull. That's pretty cool. That guy's massive. 
All right. Oh, we got skellies. Good skellies. Look at these guys. Okay, so we don't have the round joint. We got the square joint. Okay. He's got hollow toes. Usually the skelly, uh, the crazy bone skelly, these are solid. But not bad. Looks like he's kind of a redesign, but he's definitely a skelly bone style. His rib cage is a little stronger. His head's a little undersized, but he does go. You do get complete, you know, side to side where he can move his head and he just needs to have his teeth filed and stuff. But skellies are only 40 bucks, man. That is a deal. $39 for a skeleton. These are about the same quality as Menard's one. He looks really close to the, um, the Crazy Bones ones. So I'd say come to Menards and get your skeletons, man. They even got the little guys for four bucks. Giant spider, little witches. What you doing, little girl? Man, she's got a creepy ass face, man. Check her out. And she is 99, 99 bucks. What do you do, girl? Or her little ball glows. I'll put her back up. Okay, not too bad. Somebody's 49 bucks. 36 inch animated Reaper. This guy's 36 bucks. No, 49 bucks. His battery's dead. Scarecrow, I think this guy's from last year. This guy is also, I think, $99. And then they got the little skeleton. Who sings? This ought to be funny. So he jiggles and everything. Man, he had to be gold. Here's some kind of little trick-or-treater. I think these guys are all 99 bucks down here. That must be the sensor, but it's not working. So some kind of little trick-or-treater with the skull face. Did you ever look under there? Sorry, Gypsy. We're going right under your skirt. Yep, it's a little skull down there. So he must light up and do something. He's got a little pumpkin. So those guys are all 99. And then there's the cat, the bat. 40 bucks, 40 bucks, 50 for the skull. And a big web. All right, let's keep diving in. I don't know how I walked past all of them little skellies. Look at this, 299 for rats. They got spiders. Of course, they don't sell how much the spiders are. 299 for the rats. 599 for the animal skeletons, so they're probably 599. They got owls this year. They have owls last year? Little owl, his head turns, pretty cool. Owls, unicorns, dragons. Uh, they got snakes. Whoa, these are the kind you cannot pose. They stay that way, otherwise you break them. Uh, then they got the big snakes for 10 bucks, the posable ones, which are pretty cool. Oh, spiders are tree fitty. And they've got a bottom, which is really cool, like the Dollar Tree ones don't have bottoms. It looks like some glitter herpy ornaments, so we're gonna move on to the next aisle. Okay, so they got all the pumpkin hollow lights. They got the projectors for 30 each. But this is the one I really like. This is the Jemmy Fire and Ice, but they call it Fire Blaze. That thing looks awesome. And those are 25, totally worth it. All right, let's keep digging. Okay, we got some tall ceramic pumpkins for 35. And of course, ooh, gnomes, 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 gnomes. Stupid freaking gnomes. They make their appearance again. They got $20 milk cans. That's not too bad. These guys are probably 18, 20 inches tall. Pumpkin lanterns. 39. Candies. Ooh, they're on clearance. Nine bucks. Lanterns. They look reduced gnomes in the face. Looks like they got another phone again this year with the skeleton hand. Everybody's doing bottles for 10 bucks, although these are big, and they got herpified glitter. Not touching. These guys were back from last year. These are heavy as hell. Ceramic skulls for 20 bucks. Of course, they got Nightmare Before Christmas, $4. Not even gonna talk about them. Well, these guys are reduced already, five bucks. Purple People Eater. Oh, they brought these guys back from last year to the little vintage guys for uh, nine bucks. So you can't beat that. They got a cat, little skeleton guy. I think they were like $12 last year. See, they got a mummy, 20 bucks. This guy's probably 18 inches tall. Looks like he's had a light in him. And they got a big head basketball mummy for 40 bucks. They got a basketball head Frankenstein for 40 bucks. Not really a fan. And they got two little mummies over here. These guys are 40 bucks. 
no, 34. And they are brought back from, I think they've been around for about three years now, so. Uh, so we got a little bit more to go. Let's go dig in, man. Okay, we got all our party supplies, window clings, pumpkin buckets for two bucks. They're pretty thin, but two bucks for kids to hold candy, not bad. They brought the foam dragon masks back from seven bucks last year. Blue, the green, the red, those are really sharp. The greeters are only 10 bucks this year. So that's not too bad. A couple of chintzy blow mold masks. Got a crappy it for 14 bucks. And then they got an end cap. So Menards has their own village stuff called Pumpkin Hollow. They no longer do Lee Max. Let's scan over all this. Man, that's crazy. There's a little clown house. Wool of Bat Brewing Company. There's a troll under a bridge. Lloyd, come to Menards. Find a Menards, Lloyd. Lloyd, get Menards. The spider going up and down is really cool too. I dig that. Another little factory, that's really cool. But they're reasonable. I mean, you're talking like 40 bucks, 70 bucks. Called FG Square. Usually it's Pumpkin Hollow brand like that guy down there. So I don't know if that's a new thing or what. That's new to me. Of course, we got more inflatables. We got a dragon for 44. The sisters, Harry Potters. And they got some more stuff over here. They're hiding. Y'all trying to be slick on me. Oh, little blow molds. So here's a little kids. 32, 24, 17 for the little mummy. And a blow up cat for nine bucks. And of course, freaking gnomes. The purple witch, 15 bucks. How adorable. Here we go. The reaper, 35 bucks. He's pretty cool, man. He's in an actual metal scythe that's what the thickness of tin foil, but he's wooden. Man, they got a ghost and a pumpkin stack too. And it looks like they got hay bales, small sizes, for 10 bucks. All right, man. I'm trying to see if there's anything left. All right, YouTubes. That's uh, our Menards video. Yes, this is a Yeti Dragon Hot Rod. Um, pretty cool. Maybe I'll come back to another video if they add some new stuff. If not, man, the animatronics. I don't know if that's the Home Depot witch from last year or not, but uh, man, they got some big stuff out. So hit you up with Menards, get you some animatrons, and some cool Halloween stuff, man. It's more than just a box store. All right, folks, we'll keep shopping all summer long. See you in the next one. Keep it evil.